Timur Valiev <coughs> is going to meet Jamal Emers at uh, UFC on August 1st and uh, let's make the announcement. Timur Valiev is actually the former WSOF fighter, brown belt in BJJ Master of Sports in Sambo, riding on a score of 13 to the guy <coughs> who scored International Procreation Federation World and European Championship in third place in World Cup. At grappling, he was Russian Open winner. At Kudo, he was the champ of Dagestan. In head to hand combat, he was also the winner of Dagestan Open and uh, WSOF. He fought some really big names, for example, he defeated Adam Akvaviva, Isaiah Chapman, Ed West, Tito Jones. He lost to Chris Gutierrez but then bounced back with a victory. Then competed at PFL where he choked off, out Rosinaldo Silva and outworked Max Koga and Begbulat Magomedov. Really, really powerful fighter, very powerful name. He is pretty much known for his submissions but also fair striking, he is better fighter on the ground. In the stand-up he is known for his good hands and especially, but especially, superb level of cardio. Timur Valiev presses the opponent all the time, grapples well and likes to take the fight to the ground and he is pretty, pretty good in clinching. He is good in exchanges. Alright, you can't call him a world-class striker, but you can call him a good striker on the bottom. And a good striker on the top, I mean when he is on the ground. Jamal Emers, known under the nickname of uh, Pretty Boy, Jamal Emers is riding on a score of 17-5 uh, and uh, he competed at some powerful promotions like RFA, LFA, then a white contender series where he lost to Julian Arosa or Julian Arosa, however you call him, via head kick and punches, but in other promotions, Road to M1, Final Fight Championship, and uh, LFA, he had good results actually, he choked out Rafael Barboza, outworked Jay Cucinello, Kaya Machado, Fard Muhammad, Guillermo Faria, he defeated Chris Savida too, Corey Sandhagen, he lost to Thiago Moises, a really really good name, who's now a UFC fighter, to Ray Trujillo, so he was losing to big names, but he was uh, winning some big names too, and uh, got to say, he defeated in the early stages of his career Alexander the Great Hernandez, now a powerful UFC fighter. He has two victories over Brett Ewing, but looking back at his fighting style, he is a complete mixed martial artist. He knows everything, good on the ground, good with submissions, good with punches, good with striking. His wrestling is kinda, well let's say kinda so-so, but uh, Timur Valiev likes to fight of the clinch and I believe he is slightly better in the clinch than Jamal Emers. I also believe that uh, Timur Valiev is slightly better with grappling and submissions but when it comes to striking I'd give advantage to Jamal Emers. Stamina. Well stamina is a critical question you know because uh, Giga Chikadze in the only match of Jamal Emers UFC run outworked Jamal Emers via very close split decision and I believe I believe uh, Jamal Emers was better in round one, then he started slowing down, so as the fight advances towards round three, I believe there will be more chances for Timur Valiev. So, gonna be a hell of a fight actually, but I don't know, very, very slight advantage to Timur Valiev, but I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm a huge fan of Jamal Emers, especially after that fabulous war against Giga Chikadze, so gonna be a close fight, but anyway, very, very slight advantage to Timur Valiev.